the fun of all this. Yeah. How did this holiday treat happen? Yeah, let's check in with oh, the, the miracle. Tell us how it formed. The miracle. It's all about the cold air mingling with the moisture and, and everything coming together just right. The timing mm -hmm. working out something so rare in this part of the country. And boom, check out these snow totals we had across the region. Just about everybody getting at least a coating. And you can see it on these rooftops as we fly over using the KHU 11 drone, a coating to two inches firmly around Houston, Pearland, Katie Brenham, but there was one area near College Station that saw as many as six inches of snow and it fell in just a matter of a few hours, making for a true winter wonderland there in Aggieland. But for everybody, it was a treat. Typically, the snow seems so isolated when it does accumulate, but we all got to enjoy it this time. So we've been talking a lot about the precipitation types, right? We had sleet the other day, those ice pellets. This is what happens. This is, let me just give you a rundown. This is the rain, right? You have warm air all the way through the atmosphere. It falls as liquid. When there's sleet, you have rain falling into a, a cool air mass, like a sub-freezing air mass, and then it becomes little ice pellets and falls. That's what we had the other day. And with the snow, the cold air goes all the way from the top of the sky to the ground. So there's nowhere for that moisture to melt and it falls as flakes. The moisture precipitating into little crystals. So it's kind of neat to see it all happen. And this is how it all happened. Subfreezing air from the ground to the sky that combined with dense water vapor forming ice crystals like you might see on your window on the coldest winter night where just the 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 the, the water vapor in your house condensates and you get those little feathers uh, if you've ever gone skiing maybe you see that in the mountains well those crystals grew into flakes until they were too heavy to float and they fell down to the earth in the miracle <laughs> that we just enjoyed with all this snow all right, guys, coming up, we'll talk about some freezing temperatures coming our way tonight, but no more snow in the forecast. All right, now we know how it happened. Thanks, Brooks.